advancement a career. The coronavirus hasn't affected hiring at the jail, according to the sheriff, but it has affected the facility as a whole. Burley County Sheriff Kelly Lieben says the department is spending overtime money to make sure any time there's a new arrest brought in, that person is quarantined for full 14 days. And if an inmate leaves the facility for court or any other reason, they have to start that process all over when they return. Sheriff Lieben says it wasn't as difficult to enforce in March, but now that arrests are going back up, they're simply running out of room for isolation. So there's kind of a balancing act, and we have two of our employees assigned to work on that, and they're doing an excellent job. Um, but it's every day you're looking at, okay, how long has this group been isolated? When can we move them? Can we consolidate some people and free up other areas? are still down compared to this time last year. Last May, the detention center booked 749 inmates compared to 208 in May of this year. Now to our